Hey guys, it's Casey. Welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. Today, I'm going to take you along with me to set up my Go Wild um, planner or prep planner, memory keeper, all of the above for Go Wild. Um, I've actually been like procrastinating getting ready, but I think now that it's January and we're just I don't know, less than a couple months away because I leave February 28th. Like, it's getting really real, so I need to get on the ball with setting stuff up. So, you can see that I have, like, this holographic cover. Now, this, all of this stuff I printed at home. I purchased, I'm going to move these out of the way because I know that they're, like, really glaring. So, I purchased um, the digital... Um, paper background and then like the digital um what do you call it I don't I think she calls them icons anyways these are from um Keisha Glam at A Little Spark and I'll try to remember to put links down in the description if you guys want to do all this at home so I printed this out on cardstock and then I used let me get it for you <clears throat> so I ordered some holographic clear sticker paper on Amazon. I'll try to link my affiliate link down in the description for this as well. And I just overlaid the cardstock with that holographic sticker paper and then I laminated it here at home. So those are my covers. My discs are discs that I've had from the Happy Planner for a while. Um, you should still be able to find these. I'm not sure if you can find them on the Happy Planner's website. Or, I don't know, maybe Amazon. I'm not sure where you can find them. If I see them on Amazon, I'll leave a link down below. Or if I have, like, a Happy Planner link, I'll leave that in the description as well. But this blue color, you'll see, just, like, goes perfectly with the blues in this leopard print. Like, it's, oh, I'm so excited. Um, so, I went ahead and cut my own dashboard dividers. Of course, I sell these in my shop. So, my first tab is going to be, like, all things getting there okay um getting there and coming home so pre-planning so i did schedule my flight um on the 5th and i have sticky notes covering all my personal information because you know stalkers like i don't know who watches these videos so um i am going to be going from the 28th of february through the 6th of march so i have my flight information oh and i did book a round trip flight on southwest for $160. Actually, I upgraded, not upgraded, I changed my flight to get in a little bit earlier, so it was like $191. So, anyways, you can't beat that. Um, I'm in South Carolina, so flying to DC round trip for less than 200 bucks is pretty dang good. Then I just printed some information on taxis. Um, this is more information on taxis with like a little map of the city. Just in case, now one of my roommates um, is actually going to pick me up from the airport, so I shouldn't have to do a taxi or an Uber or the Metro Rail. This is just in case I need the Metro Rail. Um, that website is WMATA.com if you need the Metro Rail. And then this is just more information on getting to taxis and shuttles and whatnot. Um, hopefully, I won't have to do that unless, you know, something happens and my roommate can't pick me up. So then I have my Hilton reservation. Um, we're staying on site at the Hilton. This is my Go Wild official ticket. My receipt from Go Wild. I am going to the Shop Summit that Wednesday, March 1st. And then my insert. So I have another divider here. My inserts, all of these came from Lights Planner Action. So Bess has printable inserts and so I just printed everything out. Um, so I think I'll just go ahead and put the planner together and then we'll flip through all of that. Um, I am working on making my own contact cards. So I love these. Um, I'm not going to be selling these or offering these, you know, anything like that. Um, I'm not an official Go Wild sponsor. Maybe if they have Go Wild next year, I'll consider doing something like that. But these are just my own um, that I've made with Keisha Glam's, like, little icons, digital icons that I used or that I purchased. And then I have a QR code for all of my information that's right on my card. I'll also have a, um, oh gosh, what are they called? the dot things that go on my phone that have like you can just scan my phone and get all my contact information but I want to have contact cards um as well this is my first go wild so I'm like trying to research and figure out everything that I need you know to be a cool kid <laughs> so um I'm like super excited these are photo uh, inserts from 
the Happy Planner. Like, this is really, really old Happy Planner release stuff that they had for their memory keepers. You should be able to find these as well, I would think. Um, if I can find some links, I'll link them in the description for you. But I'm just going to throw these in there just because, I don't know. I never know what I want to put in these. Um, so, there's that. I think I did order... A little card wallet that I'm gonna try to see if it will fit all of the contact cards that I get from all my planner people at the conference and then this um, folder is from I don't know if you oh, excuse me if you remember the winter release a couple maybe a few years ago was the planner babe collection and so that's what this folder is from it's from the happy planner so I just thought that it, you know, kind of matched the whole aesthetic here. So let's go ahead and put this together. Um, I, I don't know if I'm going to fast forward through this part or not. We'll see. I don't know. Maybe I'll talk through the whole thing. So while we're putting everything together, y'all let me know. Are you going to go wild? I know um, a lot of you have said that you're not going, but... Um, I have, so I've been in the planner community basically since 2019, so 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, I don't know, it's not been five years, so maybe like three or four years. Um, my first planner I did buy in 2019, it was the Supermom Planner, um, and so that's when I kind of got started. I started my YouTube channel in 2019, then I tried to do my shop blah 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 so yeah a whole lot of things and I've always wanted to go to um a go wild conference but I don't know if it's my anxiety or if it's like trauma related because I never ever wanted to leave my boys at home with my husband um so anyways the west coast was just like too far for me so when they announced this year that they were going to be on the East Coast, I was like, oh yeah, I got to go. Like, And I have battled back and forth with my decision. I still battle it every day, um, whether or not to leave my boys. But I know that this is something that I need to do. This is something that I've wanted to do for years. I want to go meet all of my planner people. I want to meet y'all. Um, I have so many friends on Instagram that I've met over the years that I want to go and meet. I want to put a, a real face to the name, not just an Instagram face, not just a YouTube face. And so I want to do this. And because my anxiety and those negative voices in my head keep telling me reasons that I shouldn't go, I'm going to fight those um, and I'm going to go. So, it's getting really real now. Like, back when I bought my ticket in September, it was like, eh, you know, that's in March. You know, I'm not going to worry about that right now. Plus, the fact that even though I'm a planner, I'm also a um, closet procrastinator. <laughs> so, I'd be procrastinating everything to the last minute. So, here we are. Second week, what is it? Today is January 11th. I don't know. Second, second week in January. Finally actually feeling like getting my go wild stuff together so i wanted to do this video and show you guys um that you know even because i don't want to go order a bunch of like printed stickers number one because that stuff's expensive and the economy i think has killed my business so money is very tight for me right now like very very tight um but you know two i have all of the available materials and things that I can print and make my own planner so I wanted to go ahead and just do all digital all down downloadable everything um, you know that I can do right here at home and I want to show you that it is possible so um, let's go ahead and oops sorry I hit the camera let's do a flip through now that I've got it all together so this is where I need you, your guys's help. Help me decide as we flip through this planner and you see what's in each section. Help me decide what to label my tabs as because you know I have like custom dashboard tab la labels available in my shop. So I just can't right now off the top of my head think of anything to make these labels. But as we go through this video, you'll kind of see what's behind each tab and maybe down in the comments below, y'all can help me decide what to um 
you know, make my, my custom labels be for each section. So, okay, this first section, like I said, is all my information on, you know, flights, all our, my receipts and whatnot. So that's there. And then we have some dog hair. <laughs> and then we have, this goes into Bess at Lights Planner Actions uh, Principles, okay? So this first section she calls Wild Planning. And this is just um, where you basically pre-plan your trip, okay? So she has all of her um, inserts are kind of like, social media phone screen related all right so you'll see all these icons and things here um but then we've got planners gone wild we've got um your hotel confirmation so i can fill in all of this stuff flight details airport transportation it's basically like a memory book um because i do have my receipts and stuff in there but i want to write all this in and you know color it in and decorate it and speaking of that I decluttered all of my desk drawers and I found this. So if you guys remember the Happy Planner Washi um, like sticker books, I actually bought this, I don't know where, on clearance for $8. So these washies inside here, I think really match the um, Go Wild theme. So a lot of these um, like purples and, and kind of like cosmic colors like those. Um, so these will be really cool to decorate in this memory planner um just to match the whole go wild theme so if you have this and you're like me and you've kind of forgotten that you have it this would be perfect to decorate this type of um thing <clears throat> so anyways so we have um just different things to write in here um to borrow two more weeks to go so i can fill this out as we get closer um and then we have roommate profiles i did um print one two three so I got four of those um I think she's got three I don't know somehow I ended up with four I don't remember maybe three or four and then we've just got graph paper in between um so we have there <coughs> and the reason I said that is because I think that the hotels I want to say they only let four people in there maybe I don't know Maybe I'll just print some. I was having a time trying to print these things. So anyways, um, so then we have, I guess this is just a, like a little quote sheet. Um, what do I pack for Go Wild? So this is something that I need to do right now because little things like contact case, contact solution, um, my glasses, my Apple Watch charger, things like that that I may forget. I need to put those in here so that I don't forget. And then she has a place for an outfit planner. I doubt I'll be planning outfits. I'm a, like a t-shirt kind of chick. So, you know, t-shirts and comfy pants. Um, so then we have create a plan. What's on your budget? So you can put your items and your costs here. You can do where you're going to buy merch from, which I've already, this is part of the merch purchase. Then you have planner bestie. Uh, places to go in Washington. Food to eat in Washington. Things to buy in Washington, llamas to see in Washington, um, and then we go to wild days, okay? So this is more like the planner while I'm there, all right? So um, we've got Wednesday, March 1st, which I will be at the um, Shop Summit, and then we have Thursday, March 2nd, the kickoff for Go Wild, and then we have Friday, Saturday, and we have a reflection page and then we go into speaker profiles so we have different speakers that will be at the conference um so i'm definitely gonna take notes so she gave you room to take notes for after each speaker or during each speaker their name their handle notes quotes and you know maybe a little picture or whatnot so we have all of that here and then we go into that moment when and then you can fill in. And so, like I said, this is, it's filled out like a social media post. Um, that's kind of how it's formatted. So, we have a Wednesday recap, Thursday recap, all up in my fields. You just have places to kind of memory keep in here. Um, and then we have wild reflections. We have some graph paper, a place to put photos or even jot notes. Um, and then we have a cute little coloring page. Um, some more memories. You can paste photos here. I'm not sure exactly what all I'll do here. Maybe take notes, whatever. Um, and then we have our memory, actual memory keeper called Wild Memories. 
So we go into um, conference quotes, like quotes that I want to remember. We have some note sheets here. Table mates. So um, there are 10 people to a table. So we can have, we will have, up, you know, ourselves and then nine other people that we can write their information here, their Insta handles, and then remember this about them. Then we have places, um, you know, of course, to journal. Um, <laughs> this is cute. Who wants to come sit on my luggage while I try to zip it? Um, my top three moments in Washington. Just some more reflections. Killer swag. Best thing I drank. Never forget. Born to be wild. Remember this. Um, just really, really cute memory keeping. Um, this is for Planjama, where you can put photos or notes or whatever from um, Planjama. Then we have Wild Contacts. I have no idea what this is. Just I don't know. Um, and then we have Wild Memories. Um, another sheet where we can just do Never Forget, Llama Love, Remember. It's just really, really cute um, for memory keeping. So then we have Wild Vibe Soundtrack um, for the soundtrack played. Some more contacts, well, memory, sightseeings, and photo walks. Did that really happen? Crop it like it's hot. So this will be my first Go Wild, but I'm trying to learn everything I can about Go Wild. So I guess there's like a crop meet or crop party, which is kind of, I guess, like a scrapbooking type thing. Um, and then we have llama quotes, some graph paper, unforgettable moments, thoughts as I'm leaving, and then some more um, graph paper and then more graph paper and basically the end of the conference Sunday March 5th um, you know the end of the conference so I'll be leaving on Monday and then you already saw all of the things that I have in the back here so that is a flip through of my go wild planner memory keeper all things go wild trip um, y'all let me know what you think in the comments I'm like super excited this makes it even more real so that's it for this video hopefully y'all enjoyed um if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed yet or even if you've been here a while and you haven't subscribed yet hit that subscribe button follow me on instagram at pleasantly planned it's pleasantly underscore planned on instagram and um that's it i will see you guys on my next video thank you all so much for watching bye guys